The UCL Mullard Space Science Laboratory is the United Kingdom's largest university space research group. MSSL is the Department of Space and Climate Physics of the University College London. UCL was one of the first universities in the world to conduct space research. Since its establishment, MSSL has participated in 35 satellite missions, 10 of which are currently in operation, and in over 200 sounding rocket experiments. It takes its name from Mullard Limited, and is located in Homebury St. Mary in the Surrey Hills AONB, near the town of Dorking in the county of Surrey, England. History In 1957 Sir Harry Massey of UCL directed the first Skylark rocket experiments. In 1962 Massey led a team from UCL, Imperial College London, the University of Birmingham and the University of Leicester that developed many of the instruments on Ariel 1, the world's first multinational spacecraft. By 1966 the demands had outgrown the laboratory space available in London and Massey asked his colleague Robert Boyd to set up a laboratory, with generous funding from the British electronics company Mullard which had helped to set up the Mullard Radio Astronomy Observatory at the University of Cambridge. At that time, Boyd was the leading British researcher in space science. Joint funding from Mullard and UCL led to the expansion of his research program and resulted in the creation of the Mullard Space Science Laboratory in 1966. Dedicated premises were selected near Dorking, Surrey in an oak-panelled house at Homebury St Mary, set in beautiful grounds, where the laboratory has been based ever since. By this time the UCL group had been involved in providing instrumentation for over 100 rocket launches, mainly from the Woomera test range in Australia, but with the recent founding of the European Space Research Organisation with Massey as chairman, they were increasing involved with European as well as American projects. They produced the electron spectrometer for NASA's Cassini mission, the spectrometer for ESA's Herschel Space Observatory and the UV, optical telescope for the Swift Gamma Ray Burst Explorer. <laughs> MSSL facilities Topic Solar UK Research Facility SURF, As a part of the research undertaken within the Solar and Stellar Physics Group, SURF collaborates with Yoko, Soho, Cedes, and Trace to produce Chianti The Chianti package is freely available to all researchers subject to the condition of proper acknowledgement in all resulting publications. The grid The European Grid of Solar Observations EGSO is a project funded by the European Commission under its fifth framework programme. EGSO uses grid technology to create the fabric of a virtual solar observatory. MSSL is involved in three components of the grid. Astrogrid, as part of the UKE Science Initiative, UCL MSSL is responsible for servicing as a repository for solar data from Astrogrid. Astrophysical and solar terrestrial data are held elsewhere in the UK. GRIDSTART, in order to encourage collaboration between the grid projects that the European Commission is funding, a cluster has been created under the GRIDSTART accompanying measure project. EGSO is one of the founding partners of GRIDSTART. UCL Grid, as part of University College London, MSSL is also involved in UCL Grid activities.
Topic: Technology Management Group (TMG). TMG offers research facilities and consultancy to support the development, management and exploitation of technology within an enterprise context through two main centers. UCL Center for Systems Engineering works with the UCL Departments of Biochemical Engineering, Chemical Engineering Computer Science, Electronic and Electrical Engineering, and Mechanical Engineering to bring together expertise to develop systems engineering research, teaching and technology transfer. Center for Advanced Instrumentation Systems CAIS was formed in 1993 to promote and encourage interaction between industry and researchers at UCL working in the area of advanced instrumentation. It provides a base for the postgraduate training partnership with CIRA, has designed and implemented an MRE's course in instrumentation, has introduced an MSc in applied instrumentation, and, in collaboration with the Center for Systems Engineering, has created an MSc course in systems engineering management. In the commercial field, CAIS has formed the Specialized Instrumentation Group which has about 30 small and medium-sized companies as members, providing seminars and forums covering topics of interest. CAIS also manages the University College London KTP Centre, and now coordinates postgraduate training for a number of Faraday partnerships. Topic: Smart Optics. The Smart Optics Faraday Partnership is an active network of more than 100 businesses and academic groups with the common aim of generating new enabling optical technologies and successfully applying them commercially in a diverse range of markets. Smart Optics working on such products as the Smart Ophthalmoscope, illuminated retail signage, and ultra-precision surfaces. Faraday partnerships are intended to promote improved interaction between UK research institutions and industry. <laughs> Test facilities The MSSL Mechanical Engineering Group operates a number of test facilities which include a vacuum bakeout facility, thermal vacuum facility, a vibration facility, a cleanroom facility, laser and sputter coating facility, a westbound wire bonding facility, ultrasonic cleaning facilities, and a mechanical engineering workshop. Topic: MSSL participation in space missions. Since it was formed, the MSSL has worked on a number of different solar physics hardware projects. Its earliest involvement came with an experiment on aerial eye that made the first spectroscopic X-ray observations of solar flares. Other instruments were later flown on the OS-04, ESR-02, OS-05, and OS-06 missions. Instruments built have also flown on the Solar Maximum Mission SMM, the Coronal Helium Abundance Spacelab Experiment Chase, which was part of the Spacelab 2 missions. More recently, MSSL has played a significant role in the SWIFT mission. MSSL engineers participated in building and testing the Ultraviolet Optical Telescope instrument on SWIFT. In the future MSSL plans to participate in the Solar B and Stereo missions. For Solar B, MSSL is leading a consortium building the EUV Imaging Spectrometer EIS-1 which will provide plasma diagnostic in the solar chromosphere, transition region and corona. <laughs> Collaborative agencies 
Particle Physics and Astronomy Research Council PPARC, UK. NASA – Ultraviolet, Visible and Gravitational Astrophysics USA. NASA – Applied Information Systems Research Program USA. NASA – Living with a Star USA. Chandra Emission Line Project USA. Agenzia Spazia Italiana ASI, Italy in English. Muir, Ministero dell'Istruzione dell'Università e della Ricerca in English. <laughs> <laughs>